Hi, in this video I'm going to talk about Medicaid and what are the effects of expanding access to public health insurance. Going over a recent study that was published a couple of years ago. This study is immersed in the current debate about the impact of expanding uh, public health insurance. Especially after the much debated Obamacare um, that expanded uh, Medicaid which is a public health insurance uh, program in the U.S. that focuses on low-income individuals and families. Opinions about this program are very divided between the people who think it's a good thing and people who uh, don't think it's a good program. But until very recently, there was really little scientific evidence on the actual effect of expanding Medicaid. This study aims at providing scientific evidence for precisely this effect. And this is what we're going to see. The context they study is a, um, the health insurance experiment in Oregon. Basically, they took 90,000 uninsured low-income individuals um, in 2008, and using a lottery, the 10,000 winners of this lottery were given the chance to apply to Medicaid. This study takes advantage of this lottery, where basically 10,000 people were um, picked at random out of um, 90,000 low-income individuals that had no insurance to be able to apply to Medicaid and get insured. And since this was chosen at random, uh, we can compare the two groups and get meaning meaningful impacts of the possibility of applying to Medicaid. This random assignment is usually what is um, used in randomized controlled trials where we have a treatment group, which in this case is the ones that are able to apply to Medicaid, the guys that won the lottery, and then we have a control group, which are the ones that were not able to apply because they didn't win the lottery, and these guys will remain uninsured for sure. Now, this study looks at the results after one year from this lottery and found very positive results when comparing the people in the treatment group with the people in the control group. The people that won the lottery and were able to apply to Medicaid were 25% more likely to have insurance at the end of this year. They also had higher healthcare use, especially preventive um, healthcare. And their self-reported physical and mental health also improved. Basically, People in the treatment group felt better both physically and mentally than the people in the control group. And one of the signs was that depression rates went down. But one of the most interesting results they see is that the people in the treatment group uh, have on average lower financial strains, lower financial hardships. And we see a massive decrease in the devastating out-of-pocket medical expenditures and also a decrease in medical debt. So basically because of this program, the people that were able to apply to Medicaid had way less problems for um, financial reasons related to health care than the people in the control group. But even though uh, they reported that they felt better, both physically and mentally. At the time of the study, it was still too early to see if there was any effect on actual health measures. But they suggest that uh, a one-year window might be too short of a time frame to observe this. Okay, I'm going to put a link to the actual study so that in case you're interested, um, you can take a look at it. So just go below to the description and click on the link. Thanks so much for watching.